Hi guys, it's Jen here. I have another slow cooker Sunday recipe for you. Today I'm going to show you how to make beef and broccoli. It's similar to what you would get at a Chinese restaurant. This recipe is very easy. It's pretty much just put everything in the slow cooker. So first you're going to need one to one and a half pounds of a beef chuck roast and you're going to slice it into thin strips. And I like to get one that just has a little bit of fat uh, marbled through just so it cooks nice and tender. And I do uh, cut off the excess fat, but it does help if it has a little bit of um, fat running through. You're also going to need one cup of beef broth. And then you will need a half cup of soy sauce, a third of a cup of brown sugar, and then the recipe calls for sesame oil and my husband doesn't like the flavor of sesame oil so I just put olive oil in but you'll need one tablespoon of sesame oil or olive oil and then you'll need two to three cloves of garlic I use three because we like garlic okay so I added my beef to my slow cooker and then you're going to add your half cup of soy sauce your third of a cup of brown sugar, and then your two to three cloves of garlic. I'll get the rest of that when I can use both hands. And then one cup of beef broth, and then your tablespoon of sesame or olive oil. Okay, you're going to stir all of that around, and then you're going to cook it on low for six to eight hours. And then you're going to um, thicken the sauce a little bit with cornstarch and add your broccoli. And the broccoli will need to cook in there for a half an hour. But I will show you that once the beef has cooked for six to eight hours on low. This is what your beef will look like after it's cooked on low for six to eight hours. And you are going to remove two tablespoons of the liquid and let it cool and then you're going to mix it with two tablespoons of cornstarch and then you're going to add it um, into your beef mixture and the sauce will thicken and then you'll also add your broccoli in. Okay, your cornstarch mixture will be really thick. You'll just add that in. and just mix it around in there, stir it around in there. And I also turn my slow cooker to high just so that the sauce can get nice and thick. And then you're going to cut your broccoli into um, smaller pieces, I mean not too small, but um, just so that they can cook properly. And you'll add that in. And you're going to cover it and let it cook for a half an hour until your broccoli is tender and the sauce has thickened. Okay, this is what your beef and broccoli will look like once the uh, broccoli is a little tender. It takes about a half an hour or so and the sauce is nice and thick. And then we just serve ours over rice. So I'll show you what it looks like when it's served. This is what your beef and broccoli will look like when it's served over rice. Oh guys, this is so good. The beef is nice and tender and it has a lot of flavor. So you'll definitely want to give this recipe a try. Uh, if you have any questions at all, please feel free to comment below. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Thanks so much for watching.